There really is something beautiful about being completely in tune with nature, surrounded by the sounds of life. I really think it's where we're meant to squall! This is the Hunter Call of the Wild, a game where you hunt things, incidentally. And my goal today was simple. Kill bear, ignore crippling insecurities, and get bitches. But there was a small hiccup. I'm shit at hunting. Case in point, a moose was able to sneak up on me, but I chalked it all up to being in the dark. So I figured I'd head out of this backwater to some greener pastures. I went to Finland? I could have bought a goddamn car! Leighton Lake District, also known as the closest state park I could find, because I can't even afford my 17 OnlyFans subscriptions after those plane tickets. I was right about greener pastures. I immediately found a deer. It looks really young, but that's never stopped Drake before, so why should it stop me? Unfortunately, I shit my shot, and it ran away. Right into this wall for some reason. Damn, even the deer are getting stupider. I felt really bad about getting so close and not finishing the job, but thankfully there are clues to find out where it went. I wonder why it was running. It shit itself. Honestly, real. Now, despite having a very clear blood trail, I somehow lost the tracks, but fortunately, I found a feed zone. You see, hunting animals is surprisingly similar to killing people, believe it or not. Take it from a pro, ambushing where they eat is a great tactic. This inherently feels perverted. I'm a creep. I'm a weirdo. I only killed two, I just shot the last one twice for personal grudge reasons. And hey, I did everything right except the ammo type, but I feel like that's a common mistake. Who would know not to fire high caliber bolt action rounds into birds? I walked around in an actual circle tracking deer tracks again. I would love to say I was making an artistic statement about the lack of proper progress in today's world, but I'm pretty sure I'm just stupid. I shot a bird, and then shattered the matrix. What on earth is happening? I found some moose tracks. The moose didn't like it. I attempted to flank its position, and then it scared the shit out of me on the other side of where I was going. I saw the moose, but I'm pretty sure it saw my entire life as is the omnipotent god. How was it floating? As expected, the bullet didn't really do much. I'm not even sure if it bled from it. To feel better, I Lion king for a bit. You are in the light, therefore you are mine! The deer got away. Hey, that sound is copyrighted by the US gay. That's how we deal with content thieves around these parts. Also, I found one of the God Eaters again. Obviously, I lost it, but I did find this little question mark thing. I wonder what it is. I still don't know, but I offered money to it and a shrine appeared, so I'll praise the God of Hunters. After turning on the Deer Auditory Porn again, I just sat there for a while and, and literally nothing happened. I spent like like 20 minutes on this. I was getting really desperate, so I tried a new quote-unquote stupid unorthodox technique. Well, what do you know? I cannot believe this worked. Wait, no, 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 don't leave. Obviously, I chased the- ah! Ah, moose! Die, you demon! Oh, no, 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 time to get the shotgun. I'm in danger! I'm in danger! I was in the Beelzebub. Go back from whence you can- Okay, it's in phase. That's cool, that's fine. Uh, uh, Pope! It's not even dead, it just ran away. Wait, no, he's dead. Thank you, Jesus. Okay. I was worried I was gonna have to call an exorcist or something. With that kill, we've actually gone up the food chain quite a bit. I've killed two turkeys, a deer that I think I forgot to show, and now one of those sleeper predators, which means my focus is now entirely devoted to completing stage one of my foolproof plan. Cement my masculinity by taking the life of a bear. My first order of business was climbing up a tower, because exactly like when spying on potential victims, a high vantage point is almost always a necessity. Unfortunately, I listened to the voices. If a genie ever offers you three wishes, don't choose immortality as one of them. Looks like people have been testing fall damage since the beginning of time. Unfortunately, it looks like these people didn't have a genie. This is the first time I've ever passed up a free back shot, but sacrifices must be made in order to achieve my goal, and I swear to god I'm never getting into college. I saw bear sounds, I know, just run with it, and followed it to to a rest zone. Remember what I said about hunting being similar to killing people? My plan was simple. Find an outpost and pass the time until I could get the perfect point to kill a bear when it was least expecting it. Oh. Geez, these woods are more infested than your mom's pubic hair. I sneaked around it as quietly as when I follow people home at night to make sure they're safe, but don't want to startle them. In this case though, I'm going to kill the thing I'm sneaking up on. Oh my god, that's why they run. Speaking of which, this coward ran away. Come back here, you're meant to scare me! Anyways, I found out this tower thing isn't actually an outpost, and I was just so upset about it. My new plan is the old plan, it's back in fashion again, and basically it's to wander around until I run into it. I figured that maybe washing off my scent would help a bit, and it turns out the water does some weird things to physics in this world, so I'm just gonna leave that be. Bathing is for the weak anyways, I'm pheromone maxing. <laughs> 
Uh, that is the worst thing I've ever said. Oh, oh, the most vile shit. Deodorant wasn't just invented by big deodorant to make money. Trust me, you need that shit. Anyways, I wandered around until I found a couple of Eldritch gods just sitting there, and I, I couldn't resist. I took the shot. Nothing happened, and now I'm cursed for life. I found another shrine thingy. I didn't make an offering, but I should have, because now I'm going to have to sacrifice my firstborn. This part of the script just says, make funny noises, so... <laughs> oh, look, the bear's warning me. How cute. I followed some bear tracks, and the script wants me to make funny noises again, so... You know that feeling when, like, the wind gets knocked down of you? Yeah. Anyways, I shot the fucking bear. And, uh, and it got away. So... Wait, no, yeah, no, I did actually get it. I killed it. Yeah, this is it. It's the end. Sorry if it wasn't very satisfying. Just trust me, I don't have a point in life anymore. <laughs>